The tools required are a torque wrench with a 15 16 socket and an open end 15 16 wrench. Begin by removing the access door from the tail of the conveyor. Loosen the jam nut on the tensioning bolt and tighten the tension bolt to 23 foot-pounds. Repeat that process on the other side of the conveyor. Loosen the jam nut and tighten the tension bolt to 23 foot-pounds. Examine the belt and the conveyor by making sure that the flaps are on top of the belt and that the brush looks like it's in good condition. Start the conveyor and examine the belt to see if it's tracking off on either side. In this video, it's tracking off to the left, so we're going to tighten the left tension bolt. That will move the belt to the right of the conveyor. Slowly tighten the tension bolt until the belt is centered on the roller. Once the belt is centered on the roller, let the conveyor run for a few minutes to ensure that it stays centered. Once the belt has been centered on the roller for a few minutes, tighten the jam nuts on both sides of the conveyor. Stop the conveyor and reinstall the access door cover.